players on the ice here at the Toyota Sports Center, home of the LA Kings. But today, spinning enthusiasts and philanthropists have taken over. Grab your spin shoes, grab your bike, and get ready to participate in one of the hottest fitness trends on top of the ice. When you decided to participate today, did you realize what you were getting yourself into? I did from a, I, I spin. So I enjoy taking a small class, but this is pretty amazing, you know? Psycho House seems to be very energetic, and it's great to see different levels of riders. So it feels like we're all here for a great cause. So what they did is they put me up on stage, which was a little scary at first, but I was pretty excited about it. And uh, they put a couple of the ice girls up there and we just tried our best and the instructor was amazing. So everybody was sweating and having a good time. So I was pretty excited. This is not your average spin class though. This is the first annual Pedal for Pucks benefiting the Ronald McDonald House, a nonprofit that helps families during difficult times. So far today, it's been a big success for us, and uh, it's our first year, so we know it's going to grow every year, and uh, it's something our fans like to do, and our players are coming out, taking pictures with people that are on the ri they're riding, and uh, it's a fun way to raise money, and at the same time, we're getting in good shape. Teams and individuals are currently pedaling for donations to help families in need, but if you didn't know any better, you'd think it's just one big party. Ronald McDonald House. I am. I am. I love the work that they do. I love the fact that they provide housing and care for families who have children who are at the Children's Hospital, who are working through illnesses, and Camp Ronald McDonald. It's a great cause. And it's a great ride, you know? A great way to stay physically fit. So the Ronald McDonald House, I'm honestly so excited about that because I actually took this event very, very seriously. Um, the LA Kings Ice Crew, um, we go to so many different charity events and we put on so many different functions. But um, I raised over $1,000 today um, from all different family and friends and just being able to share on social media. And I, I mean, it's just such a powerful thing. And, and I just honestly want to help and I'm glad that I could. While there, participants enjoyed guest appearances from LA Kings players, music, and of course, <laughs> high energy instruction. What has it been like for your team to be here and, and providing an a great spinning experience for everyone who's raised so much money. It's been a blast. Uh, we work with a lot of athletes, NBA players, NFL players, NHL players, working out with us during the season, during the off season. It's really fun to be a part of the LA Kings community and throw such a special event. We're really, really excited to be here. So now we're going to get to see you up there leading the crowd, I'm going right? to be on the stage for, I'm not going to be leading, I'm going to be riding with one of my instructors. Oh, okay. Yeah. So what advice do you have for the crowd to stick with it the whole time? Stick with it, don't give up. Your brain tricks you into thinking you're not strong enough to do it, but in reality you are. Over 300 people participated in the first annual Pedal for Pucks, raising nearly $65,000 for families in need. Despite today's achievements, both the LA Kings organization and Cycle House are focused on making even a bigger impact. We're a studio that focuses on social responsibility. For every ride every single one of our customers takes, we donate two meals to a hungry American in need. So every opportunity we have to give back is really exciting to us. And what better opportunity than to do something with uh, the best hockey team in the country representing our home city and uh, it's been such an incredible time and we're really happy to have been a part of it. It's one of those we knew we had to establish and start the right way and I like that we kept it to a certain number of people and we want to make sure we did it right and then we're going to learn from it and keep moving on. We do a lot, if you go on our website, you can go LA King slash King Scare and you see we do a lot of events with our players. They're very involved and uh, we're going to raise over $2 million this year and we're going to give it back to the community whether it's Children's Hospital, Ronald McDonald House, or a bunch of other events, or a bunch of other foundations, and uh, we want to give back, and for us, it's very important as an organization. I hope we raise a lot of money for the Ronald McDonald House Charities. I think it's a great, great cause, and anybody who gets an opportunity, and thank you, LA Kings! For El Segundo TV, I'm Molly Perlman.